Hey Rimworlders, it is JPT back here on Midas 2. Let's go ahead and work on that steel incinerary, whatchamacallit, mortar. Yep, work on it. Work it, baby. Yeah, work it. <laughs> all in that steel. That's all I'm really worried about. Proceed, you're probably, eh, you're not too bad, actually. Not too bad at all. Deconstructing sandbags. Nope. I want you working on that. Uh, I want you working on that. Kia. Wow, yeah. Work on those meals. I've been keeping you away from your uh, your good work there. Um, let's wait for you guys to wake up. Probably eat a little something something. Those boomalopes are still kind of terrifying. Really want to make sure that these are good to go. Oh yeah, we need to probably get these out of the way. Someone needs to haul that. Hey, Ronnie. Just move it. Literally, just move. Okay. Just move it. That's all you had to do. Was move it. An exotic goods trader. Old school partners. Okay. Let's go ahead and have you come over here and see what they got. They got some pretty good stuff. We could still sell the dog. What's this? Ah, that's interesting. Um, I don't really see anything I want. I mean, the telescope is tempting. A television is certainly tempting, but it's so expensive. Yeah. Not in a position to buy anything like that just yet. Harvesting rice. No, we're going to go ahead and have you work on that stuff. Mining compacted steel. It's reserved. Why don't you work on this? I want all these mortars that we can get. Kia, you're good. Ronnie. Yeah, come over here and help me construct. Somebody's in a poor mood. Proceed. Well, can't help you there. Oh, good. I just realized we have mortars or molotovs right there. I guess if I absolutely had to, I could put wood down on these. I want to. I guess if they still have the plan on them, they don't fully have the ingredients they need. So that's something good to keep in mind. like all these don't have stuff. Although this one maybe does. That's interesting. So don't listen to me. I don't know what I'm talking about. It's interesting that tree's going to keep people from doing what they're doing. Yeah, these boomalope are terrifying me. I don't want them in my thing. So once we can close that off, we're closing it off. Oh good, you're building the slate wall. We still need a ton of that stuff. Yo, Fuller. Okay, you build this hurt. That's fine. Who's in a poor mood? Ronnie? Well, I didn't do it. Not this time. Now you're eating off the floor. You probably hate your life. Man, it's taking forever to build these things. The flow's just off. You guys are building the walls, though. I like that. Yeah, so I guess I was wrong about that. So we need those... I still need these. Hey, I don't... I don't really care if you're praying right now. I'm praying that you'll get this done before this episode's over. Jeez. Consuming the simple meal. Alright. Who's in a poor mood? Fresh meat? Well, again, can't help that. Uh, building slate wall. Okay. You're wearing the... Are you cold? Alright. Getting back to cooking, although you're hauling slate blocks. Yes, construct those two. That would be amazing. Oh. Nothing? All right. Must be reserved by somebody else already. Sweet. Very nice. What are you working on? Hauling slate blocks. 
Okay. Oh, I got another pirate merchant. Lassoid Transport Company. Uh, Ronnie. Call the Lassoid Transport Company. <laughs> See what they've got. They've got shells for pretty cheap. Although 31 is probably not our true number because we've got... We've got a ton here, which means in storage we have 31. I'm looking over here. Eh, maybe not. Curious. Or no, he has 31. We have none to trade. Okay. So whatever we have up there is what we have. Yeah. I'm good. What, if beer goes down to $6, I'll buy it. That's my price for the old beer. It's weird that no one's building this. Ouch. So I wonder if I cancel it. And put it back there if somebody will actually build it. Looks like they might. And no one else is doing it again. That's really weird, right? Like, that's just not me being crazy. It's just really weird. Alright, so 16. So that's going to give us 8 more. Ronnie's just relaxing socially. We don't have any more up here. Look at all this. Oh, all that iron. Slate blocks are already reserved. Go ahead and haul that steel. We've also got marble. And if I'm not mistaken, we did marble over here as well in order to build our sort of incinerator. We need 150, so whether or not we actually get that many, that'll be the big question. It's weird, though, that Cruelty Partners didn't... We released that lady. Did she die on the way? Maybe she, like, bled out. And she didn't make it to the edge of the map. I wish I would have paid attention. Normally I do. Interesting. I wonder if maybe she got killed by somebody... So they probably still blame us. Curious. Very, very curious. Yeah, so Fuller's built in. Good deal. Yeah, so he's building all the turrets. I'm okay with this. Still got this one up here that no one's building. Which is fantastic, because, you know, that's all we need in our lives. So actually what I'm going to do, just to be safe, I'm going to have somebody build wood right there. As a matter of fact, I'm going to make it Kia. Because Ronnie was about to go to sleep, from what I could tell. Because if we can't build this, then at least have something here. Kind of blocking that off. I'm a little worried. Need materials. Alright, so Fuller basically needs to get to stone cutting. Making those slate blocks. Okay, resting. No. I want you to keep doing this. You do it one more time after this, and we'll be good. Then you can go to bed. Oh yes, and so now I need power over here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. I think we're okay there. If I do that, we got power all over here. I think we need one there to power that one. Yeah. Okay. We're already getting back to it. Work on the slate wall now that we have plenty. Oh, yes. Construct. It's going to be so nice having all these done. Nice. Way to go. <clears throat> wow, my throat. These last couple episodes. My apologies. Building slate wall. Hauling slate blocks. Oh, yes. I'm feeling good in the neighborhood. Feeling good in the neighborhood. 
things are good, which means they will go bad very, very soon. Construct. Okay. Let's go ahead and have them cut down this tree because it's kind of in the way. Chop out that wood. You're resting after you cut this tree. Hauling slate blocks. That might be it. Although these two are kind of still needed. It's weird. He like brought them back just to take them there. Not just placing them there. Guess it's all or nothing with this guy. Work on the slate wall, which requires him to cut a few trees down. Oh, that's pro scene. Fuller's over here. Okay. Is this going to actually be it for us? Need materials. Probably not. Oh, man. Get it over with. Ah, all right. That just means you need to do some stone cutting. And then we're done. Oh my gosh, I'll be so happy. I'll be so happy when this is over. We have the materials. No. <laughs> yes. Technically, we're not fully complete until we do that one, but hey, it is what it is. Look how dark it got. Did it? Wait. Did it try to put a roof all over this? Uh-oh. <laughs> this is not a good thing. Expand. Yes, expand the no roof areas. This is not good. <laughs> Didn't think it was actually going to do this. Yeah. It's probably a good thing. <laughs> Don't want these walls collapsing on us. That would be my... That would be the ultimate travesty is that I get this all done and then it's like oh you weren't trying to make a closed in compound you know with structure oh our bad we still killed everybody though by crushing them to death that would be the worst day of my life <laughs> in terms of video gaming that would be so sad let's not let that happen uh, let's see, do that. I know this is like not the most exciting thing, but completely necessary in order for us not to murder everyone. You know, that would be great. As a matter of fact, so you're learning a lesson here. I hope. Don't follow my direction is probably the best lesson I can tell anybody. Yeah, because these sort of became indoors and obviously you don't want that because, well, you can't fire mortars if you have a roof over your head. And of course, this isn't easy because of all the weird contours that I've put in here. So, you know, thanks for being patient. And I would unpause it for the sake of unpausing, but, you know. Let's go ahead and maybe let that be a roof. So that, you know, everyone could keep working and you could kind of see things going on. But again, don't want to crush anybody. That would be bad. That would be real bad. Guess I should have thought about this before I got into it. All right, anywhere else? Go ahead and let the roof be on that. Um, let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, let's make these roofed. 
Mm. Yeah, I don't want these to have roofs. Oops. I think we're okay now. Ooh, that was close. That was real close. Very, very close. All right. Yeah, that's better. You want to see the shadows off the buildings. Got a visitor. Buffalo Shaman. Come on down. Yo, the next contestant on the price is right. How many meals do we got? 87. All right, so Ronnie's still researching. Whoa, a villager named Gore has arrived and is joining the colony. She is a Glitter World empath. Interesting. You're probably also naked. Yeah, you're just naked with a fine meal. You got a fine meal, girl. Oh, good. You're a cannibal. Hmm. Well, well, well. Suddenly a cannibal appears. This is not good. And I get your name now. Gore. That is hilarious. That is the most hilarious thing ever. You are the most sociable person ever. You're basically the female version of Hannibal Lecter. Because you have good medicine, which means you're going to be our doctor. You have very good social skills. And you're way too smart. Wow. And you're incapable of violent, which again, I find hilarious. So, how are we going to feed the cannibal? This might not go very well. I'm just going to go point that out. But you are picking up clothing. Um, I think we don't have a bed for you. Boom. Yeah, see these restrictions? I've really never even got into the restrictions thing. I really need to, because I really feel like it'll only enhance the game, but it is what it is. Uh, 12. So we've got a race for all that. Everyone flicks. Uh, you are the number one warden. Yeah, you're going to always warden people. Uh, handle. Yeah. Cooking. It would be amazing if you are an amazing cook. Like, you would then be Hannibal. That would be so funny. I'll let you construct. I'll let you repair. Your growing skills aren't great. Mining skills aren't great either. Smithing and tailoring. Just leave those off. Let's go ahead and make some art. Crafting is whatever. Let me, I'll make you a hauler. Lots of cleaniness. Clean, cleaniness. Not clinginess, but cleaniness. So I guess really the next step at this point is do we want to build walking paths that make things go faster in terms of flooring and then, you know, surrounding our farms with flooring. And we could. I don't think we have enough sandstone tile. Gore's in a poor mood. Well, sorry about ya. You've got dementia, cataracts, and you're frail. You have seen better days. You're also still naked. Sort of. Can't really help you there. And you observed rotting corpses. Which you should like. Will you eat anything? Is the question. Surely you will. Oh, interesting. You're just sleeping on the floor now. Yeah, you're, con you're consuming a simple meal, but you probably hated it. Eh, you didn't really hate it. Shared bedroom and you're naked. I think you can live with that. The visitors are leaving. Okay. Very, very interesting. Oh, you know what? We need to take the roof off of this. For those of you that acknowledge that. Um, there we go. So we need to be able to have this see for satellite purposes. Alright, Gore, where'd you go? I want you to haul the marble, not the limestone chunk. Although, maybe, you and Jesse are in a... It's a contest. It's a rock-carrying contest. Gore, you won. You're hauling wood. Although, go ahead and 
All the marble. That won't go away very quickly. Sorry, fresh meat. Although, don't get gore and fresh meat next to each other. Oh my gosh. That could be a bad, bad day. Ooh, that could be a real bad day. For everyone involved. Gore, where'd you go? There you are. Let's see how much of this you actually pick up. Man, you're brave going out in this thunderstorm. Very cool. The general storage. Should just take it straight to the incinerator. Which I'll probably have you do anyways. As soon as you're done putting it down. Need materials. They're right here. Marble blocks. Marble blocks. Unless somebody else is already doing it. Alright. Uh, you're going to hate me, but I'm going to send you out again. Going to send you out again. Alright. Okay. What episode is this? 95. So let's go ahead and save real quick. Rim World 95 IP. It's getting even shorter and shorter. Where are you headed off, Fuller? Hauling steel to those turrets. That's right. I do want those turrets. What kind of gear are you wearing? Enough gear to probably warrant somebody having that stuff. Oh, wow. I didn't even notice you were dead. Oh, wow. You've got a ton of great stuff. Frag grenades. Heck to the yeah. How about you come out over here and strip this guy down? Strip. Yeah. This is all of our stuff now. It's all of our stuff now. Although, gear-wise, yeah, your stuff isn't that terrible. Yeah, build those turrets. So we got short range and long range. Bolt goods trader. See what you got for sale. I feel like we, whoa, I feel like we need to start making stuff. Yeah, see, now we got all this wood. And you're going to give us $7 for all that wood. That is the saddest day. So $58 total. That kind of blows. And so much stuff for rice. Okay. We can make a little bit of money here. Maybe enough to buy a television. That sure would be nice. Don't want to sell everything, though. Do you want to sell the expensive stuff? Still leave us with something. I do want to keep... I do want to sell off, like, 500 of this, though. Enough to make the number tick to 520. So accurate. There we go. There we go. So we got simple meals. You could still sell the dog. Let's take a look and make sure we're not missing out on anything. We've got tons of berries, so you can have all that for five fifty-five. Oh yeah. And then we just this could be our downfall if I don't pay attention. Forty-nine dollars for that. No. Husky fur. Mm, that's not never gone well here. Beer is under $6. What did I say? Give me all beer. Give me all beer. We got some beer. And eight or $844. Sweet. And these guys will probably never get on the phone with us, so I'm not going to worry about it. But we have almost $1,000. I say almost when basically we're nowhere close. But I think that's a good stopping point for us here on RimWorld. As always, guys, I appreciate you tuning in. Stay tuned for further adventures. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And until next time, this is JPT. Go play your games, and I'll be seeing you.